Hey guys, how's it going? Um, it is Friday morning and we decided to switch our videos from Sunday evenings to Friday mornings just because we feel like that's a, a better time. Everyone's gearing up for the weekend. Plus, who doesn't like Fridays? Every day is Friday. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> During COVID-19, you get to wake up, you're working at home in your pajamas pretty much. You know, this is, I mean... I think if I stood up, you could see my sweatpants, right? <laughs> yeah, I think we all could. So neither one of us are going to step step up because uh, I think we are both wearing sweatpants. But anyways, Friday is my favorite day of the week, even though in the real estate world, we all know that uh, there's no such thing as Friday in the real estate world. But I still like the day of the week. Anyways, so this week we're going to talk about, um, per the popular demand vote that I posted on Facebook earlier in the week, um, one of the things that everyone want, really wanted to talk about is some updating and what's going to, um, what's better. No, no, wait, there, there was a vote for goats, a conversation <laughs> about goats. So just to acknowledge that there is still some interest there, maybe for a later video, we can maybe pr produce a whole series on goats. So maybe just so you sure. guys know, um, we, we might have to, you might have to actually, I don't know why I said them. You might have to actually produce a live video because I've got people knocking down our door saying, Dan needs to do a video about goats. <laughs> it might be on the way. You never know. <laughs> okay, keep stay tuned for that. Um, anyway, let's get into what we're yeah. going to talk about. Today. So we're going to talk about uh, updating your kitchen versus finishing your basement. Um, what's what's better? What's going to get you the bigger return on investment? Um, or what's better to do? So I think that updating your kitchen is a much better idea. And Dan thinks that I personally think that investing in you know finishing a basement and qualifying this that you know it could be updating your basement whatever's finished true if you have you know paneling or if you've got some old carpeting in the basement or um, some of the features that maybe buyers aren't looking for today um, updating it but I think also we kind of focus on uh, just finishing your basement because um, you know, from my perspective, I think that's probably the best place to spend your investment dollars. Um, it expands out your living area, gives you an opportunity to send the kids to the basement for a playroom, right? And put a lock on it. And, <laughs> Just kidding. Not good advice. Carry on. <laughs> you can uh, do what you will. Um, you know, it gives you a place for the kids to go, kids to play. You can kind of hide the toys in the basement. Um, you know, when the kids get older and they don't want to move out, it's a good place for them to live for a while. Um, it's always a good place, you know, just to get away for a few minutes, you know, if you want to. Make it into a, you know, look at a couple pictures we're going to post up here. I mean, we, you can turn it into a movie room. You can turn it into, um, you know, there's some super high-end and really nice, uh, you know, cigar lounge style basements that people have finished out. Um, you know, wine rooms, wine storage, rack areas. Um, and, you know, when at the end of the day, I mean, we're realtors, so we kind of talk about, you know, what's powerful when you sell a house and having that additional living space in the basement, um, you know, gives the buyers a lot of new opportunities. So, I mean, I, I agree with that. I, I, I like all of those ideas. And to be honest with you, we have to do both still. I know personally, we have to still finish our mm -hmm. basement and we have to update our kitchen. But, I think updating the kitchen is a better idea and it's going to give you more return on investment than finishing a basement just because, I mean, when you walk in the front door, the kitchen's on the first floor. The kitchen's the focal point of the household. So that's what people see when they first come in. It's a good point, but I'm statistically driven and, you know, based on the research that I've seen, there's a higher return on investment. It's like 70 or 75% return on investment by finishing your basement. And if you're handy enough to do some of this on your own, you know, you very much could make a, a much higher return. But but where do you spend the majority of the time with your family? I mean, we, we know, we spend every evening in our kitchen, leaning on the counter, cooking dinner, sitting at the bar. I mean, Blake comes downstairs all the time and eats his ginormous bowls of ice cream at the bar every single night. And, you know, I just think that that's the focal point. We spend more time there cooking. Um, and I personally think, and I know you've said it, but I, he thinks that the basement will give you a higher return on investment, but I personally think that having an updated kitchen um, for the purpose of selling your home is gonna give you a higher return on investment, sell it quicker than having a finished basement. Fair argument. So, 
at the end of the day, you know, it's up to you and what you invest your dollars in. Um, you know, especially if it's a, if it, if you're in a, you know, your home's your your forever home. Make it your own and mm -hmm. enjoy it, live in it. Um, you know, you certainly don't have to take her recommendation for where to uh, invest your dollars. And um, I'm gonna show some pictures real quick. I want to show some before and after pictures of a kitchen just to finalize my point. So we're gonna look at a couple of these befores and afters. And imagine walking into a house that had the old kitchen versus the new kitchen. So, and of course, we'll, we'll show some pictures if we haven't already seen them earlier in this video of some different options and things that you can do with the basement. But, uh, but I'm really interested to hear what you guys have to think. And uh, I, I want a vote here on, on what you guys think is, is gonna be. Yeah, decide for yourself. Let us know, okay. let us know what you think. Um, if you were gonna tackle one major project of upgrading in your house, would it be finishing the basement or would you upgrade your kitchen? Yep, good to know. All right, guys. Thanks so much for tuning in. We'll see you next Friday morning, and we will discuss the topic at that time. Have a good one.